Here is Marques Allen. I'm still a little bit concerned, Walt, that you were buying 15 pounds or 15 bags of cement. Look, I know I owe you money, but does that mean I have to become part of your foundation? What's going on at the Gray household? Some people have ended up in cement, and I hope you're not one of them. Never know. Oh, goodness. This is going down. Yeah, okay. All right. Moving on. Let's talk about entertainment. Uh, one of your favorite shows is coming back, plus Tom Cruise is masking up. Why? You'll find out here. Take a look. Well, you seem pretty excited about it, sir. Just in time for the election, one of the most loved TV political dramas of all time coming back, kind of. The cast of The West Wing will reunite for a special for the streaming service HBO Max. Stars Martin Sheen, Rob Lowe, Allison Janney, and more. And show creator Aaron Sorkin will drop in some new material. The special is going to raise money for the nonpartisan organization When We All Vote, whose aim is to drive voter turnout. You are a freaking Navarro cheerleader. It's definitely a privilege. The Netflix series Cheer is up for a bunch of Emmys this year, including Best Cinematography for a Reality Program. That category has a whopping 47 individual nominees, and only two of them women. Cheer directors of photography Melissa Langer and Ellen Patrick say the nomination itself is a win. The more visibility that we have, the easier it becomes for that playing field to be level. The Emmys air September 20th on ABC 10. Wear your mask. Tom Cruise is trying to inspire people to go back to the movies. He tweeted a photo of himself going to see Christopher Nolan's Tenant in a theater in London, mask and all. Tenant opens next week in the U.S. in cities where theaters are in fact open. So what did Cruise think of the sci-fi drama? I loved it. He's no dummy. He's reminding you that eventually you'll be able to go back to theaters just in time to see Top Gun 2. It's on the way.